there is a story on a king that said to to his people the 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 person that will take that boulder from this mountain to the other mountain he will marry the princess great all of the heroes all of the soldiers everyone came who doesn't want to marry the princess and maybe to be the next king like it's a, the 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 best thing in the world. Everyone came and the looking on that crazy boulder, it was huge, gigantic. No one can even push it, can even move it. Like trying, nothing moves. And one person tried to do this and the other one tried to do that. And like everyone are going one after the other, giving up and saying, okay, I, I, I can do it. No one can do it. Everyone are falling to sadness and despair. And in the end, there was one young person, regular person, a farmer or something, and he said, you know what, I'll start. And he took out his hammer and start breaking the boulder to pieces. And he took a few stones in his hands and passed it to the other. And like after two or three months, he finished breaking this boulder and transferring all of the pieces from one side to the other. And he got the, the, the price. He got married with the princess. The king, he said you need to transfer the boulder from one mountain to the other. He didn't say in one piece. Okay, you need to cross that wall. Those are your fears. No one said you need to. No, I can't break that wall. Who said so? People ran away, escaped from Alcatraz prison with a spoon. I've been to Alcatraz, not in a prison, yeah, in a tour. But I was there. You can make it out with a spoon. You can make it out with an automatic weapon, but they did. The tunnel is still there. You can, the person was carving his way out uh, with a spoon, with a teaspoon. Crazy. The answer, yes, but you know why? Because he wanted to be out. And when you want, you're going to be out. If he found his way out from that crazy prison, on the island, with the crazy sea, the ocean, from like in the middle of the night, in the middle of the winter, and, and he did it, and he escaped. So you can do everything, because that is an impossible mission, and someone did it. Why? Why is it important for us to mention? To learn about ourselves. So you're confront confronting crazy fears in your life. Yeah, I understand. You've been humiliated, you've been abused, you've been crushed. Wonderful. The answer is yes. We're not saying no, it was okay. No, it was bad. It was the worst. The worst that could have happened, happened to you. Really? Yes. Let's say yes. Now, you need to pass from that stage. And yes, you're not able to push that wall away from you. But who said that you should do it once in one time? Take your teaspoon and start carving. Start shaking that wall. Slowly, slowly. One brick after the other. <laughs> Kick it. <coughs> Sit. Think. Plan. Pray. Push. Bring a stone. Bring a friend. Bring a rabbi. Do something. Fila. Tzedakah. Tshuva. Something. Every day do one thing. Every day give another kick in the wall. Every day, come and kick the wall and, and go. That's what you're able to do every day. Curse the wall. Even just protest. Really, come and curse the wall. Say, I wish you will be down. I want you to go down. One day you will fall on your face. Come, scare him. Fight with him. Do something. 